We are trying to fix this deep sea diving suit. We fixed the lungs. We have put in the depth of pressure, pressure for the, the suit. We've just got to find out now how to fix the heating element. Now this is a new area that's just unlocked, so let's see what we can see. You are in product storage, a restricted area. Product so storage sounds good. Unpowered terminals, cry cryo eggs. A row of corpses hangs like grotesque, grotesque puppets, tangled in the pipes and wires that had once provided life. Now no more than a lifeless troop of dry husks. Right, so there's nothing we can do in here. There's no... Operator's chair. Greens. Glare and ruby symbol indicating either a lockdown or malfunction. Okay, there's nothing we can do in there, so that's not helpful. We've turned all those pods off. A heating element. I'm pretty sure we've explored all of this. I think the... Right, okay. So, basically where we ended last episode was we blew this open with him. Oh, is this a new PDA? It's not a new PDA, is it? It is. This must have fell out as well. I didn't read this last last episode. Atlas Moon Researcher. Has it been five years already? I've been down here for so long that I've forgotten how the sun feels on my skin. My ocular implants are malfunctioning again. I really must stop procrastinating and get them checked out. Corporate offered to do a complete ocular transplant, but I refused. Being blind from birth has its benefits. My visual memory isn't clouded by manipulation and interpretation. This is not a disability, but a blessing in the land of the deceived. Oh, she's got. she does have a point does have a point but then again I understand what she's saying is that if you can't see things you can't be deceived by something sparkly and shiny or something that looks good superficially however the same would apply to sounds something sounds nice something sounds good you could be deceived by it you know what I mean and then you can't rely on your vision to see if it's bad or not. They work in tandem with each other. So you can't Yeah, it, it's it's a bit of truth to it, but not 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 absolute. Dr. Kubilius has further tuned my bionics to interfere with the deep sleepers. So I can keep them under observation 24-7. An unseen bonus is that once I'm connected to their limbic system, I can access their emotions. I find catharsis in reliving their lives and seeing the world as they did when they walked free among the flock. I have loved before many years ago. She always saw the best in me, my Diana. I keep telling myself not to obsess over the products, but I just can't help it. I am particularly fond of the Fritius family. Corporate acquired them two years ago, and they were shuffled around a lot before coming here. One moment on a trip to Mars, another shanghai to the bottom of the ocean. My favourite is product a 45 a 3 he has magni magnificent emotions, so passionate and raw. Her dreams are fascinating. Appreciating her emotional range doesn't make me less culpable for her desecration, but it does make the work more enjoyable. All these researchers are tapped. I am pleased to report that the isolation in cell cultures using immunofluorescence based an analytical procedures and nucleic acid determination molecular approaches has proven so successful in detecting and identifying a PS139 strain in the historical samples. It was a mule poker night and I won big again. Perhaps they sense my loneliness. I really hope they're not letting me win. Dr. Moon, my report is attached for your perusal. The stasis pods of the three products I requested for study have just arrived. I will begin my observations post haste. I'm racked with guilt. Who knows where these products were headed when they were procured? Now they linger in eternal sleep, poked and prodded in the name of scientific progress and profit. Their autonomy was disregarded, and their rights in their bodies were violated. 
The other employees in this lab are under the illusion that these people volunteered. Their ignorance is appalling, or they may know the truth and choose not to dwell on it. In the old days, we would have done the PS139 research off-world, but since the resurrection of the Father, who can stop us? Who would dare to question the company and, by extension, the church? I overthink everything enough. Moon, your guilt changes nothing. I knew she was special when I first connected with product A45 5A3's Lucid Dreams. I'm going to name her Diana. The deep sleepers are kept in stasis, so they remain fresh and compliant. We seldom wake them unless an experiment or treatment requires it. Products are never allowed to leave, but maybe, just maybe, I have enough clout with corporate to change this policy. She fell in love with an experiment. Lads, this is just nightmare fuel all around. I'm sure PS139 is an ancient organism that remained dormant for a long time, owing to the cold temperatures and water pressure. Now, in the warmth of the mule lab, we are resurrected it. Airfast and his team are proceeding with human testing after the Omega Base incident. Even haven't observed PS139's necrotic effects. The company sees dollar signs while I see death of humanity, but what can I do? I've made up my mind. Whatever response I get from Choker, I am setting these people free. Notice of Mule Senior Staff. Report to your personal EV for immediate evacuation. Base lockdown in progress of Black Ops team en route. Quarantine has been unexpectedly painful, but it provides the perfect cover to set Diana free. My personal EV is primed and ready for us. We'll be out of here in five minutes. Then we can start a new life together. Help, the AV jammed and something is wrong with Diana. She's something grown inside of her. Oh, Kane. Well, that's what you get. Look around and find out. Okay. What items do we have? Oh, we've got an ass. We've got a torch. We've got a torch. That's heat. It's empty though. Where will we get a fuel source? I don't suppose we can just put the torch in here. No, we need to... Fuel for the torch. I know where we did ref... No, that, that, that's ages ago. We can't get back there. How we refueled the canisters. Hmm. Um, let me check this room, actually. Aha! Does this have... No. Do you know what it is? I think I am going to take this hint. Because I haven't... Wait, 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 before we do that. Ah, we'll cut this. Coolant. Contained solution looks designed to cool and regulate body temperature. As long as it's plugged into a match and... Okay, so wait there. So we don't need a, a heating element. I thought we needed to keep the suit warm, not cool. Then again... Maybe we do need to keep it cool, because the lower the... Nah, that wouldn't work. It's a pressurised suit. There we go, we did it. Ah, we, we don't need to keep the suit cool. We need to keep the lungs cool. Ah, I, I, was, I just presume we needed to heat the suit, suit up. That's where I thought the torch might be used for that. Okay, now... We've put the correct pressure calibration in. Let's go, baby. Train systems, biotechnological deep atmosphere environment suit. Systems check. Alert. Apparatus is operating with an established parameters. Ready for deployment. Excellent. Okay. Here goes uh, something.
Take a look, that's the only description this has. Right. I imagine the red dot is where we are. Massive under lads, we just we just entered a rapture. We'll head north west first. Are you outside? Yes, it's... Mac... Oh, it's incredible. It's... It's the bottom of the ocean. I get that you're fascinated by it, but remember where you are. A place no human was ever meant to survive. Be careful. So beautiful. In. That is some sort of creature, isn't it? Look at the state of this. Seabed. Maintenance panel. Before we go to the maintenance panel, what is this? It's exit. Right, wait there, we can exit that way. If we want to. Without return to the mule, divers can use maintenance panel to perform routine upkeep. Mac, this looks like the exterior of your escape pod room. And uh, I found a terminal. Would it get you in here? No, but it might get you out. If I can equalize the pressure in there. Okay. I'd prefer not to have my brain blow out of my ear canals though. Noted. Uh, hold on. It's behind a cage. That's what we need a cutting torch for. Okay. High five! Oh, there we go. We've already found it. That's, that's pretty cool. Right, okay. Tricky. Loading means acetylene cartridges. Have to listen for the click. Yeah, baby. I'm a beast at breaking and entering. It's a little jellyfish. Warning, escape pod F7 is jammed. Open flood back floor. Yes. Cycling pressure injectors. Mac? <laughs> You're now a free man. Tell me I'm amazing. You're amazing. Um, you didn't have to say that. Right, so level 1 plus access is required for this terminal. I imagine we're going to need to find another hand implant or some sort. That's, oh, an access card. We don't have anything like that. Okay, well, before we switch to Matt and get him out of there, let's go through here and find out where it takes us. Beacons. So now we're there. We were there. We're there. Okay. Nice how they've mapped out the underwater. life down here at this depth jellyfish hope's second favorite she loved how they bounced my charlie my hope my charlie sharks danger sharks so whatever that other one it was a danger sign danger some creature danger shark we know what that is Bloody shark. That's leave. But hold on, Did, haven't we missed something? Oh no, that's the exit, that's what we saw, that, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, 
keep going. Crane control terminal. We'll check all the other blue things out first because normally they're pieces of the puzzle. We're there now. That's oh, there's the there's the Mac. pod. Mac, are you there? Look. You found the rover. Good girl. Yeah, yeah, it's a Fido. It looks intact too. How are you going to get to it, though? Uh, good question. Stand by. Easy. I'm a crane operator. Shit. But right, I think this is the job for him, isn't it? Or the bear. Right, let's see where we can go with this guy. Oh, we go down. Body lies face down, half submerged in water, blighted by crimson ichor, expelled by the twin cadavers. Both victims bear two bullet wounds, evidence of efficient slaughter. These were all killed by the cleanup crew. Door access. Oops. Kane. More bodies. Yeah, but these were executed. They were shot in the back of the head. Gunshots. I heard gunshots. Many gunshots. Days ago. Weeks ago. Eons ago. My head. Don't trust this guy. Oh, lovely. We've got the key card for the control pad. Hopefully that's a level one plus. I s once saw a guy minced up by lasers trying to use a stolen key card. He is hoping this place is less reliant on murder traps. Uh, oh my god, why did I do that? What is my life right now? <laughs> you should sterilize your hands, Mac. I really should. Why is my first instinct to to desecrate a corpse? That is hilarious. What a beast. Can we set it on fire? No. Right, that's it. Right, we've got teeth. Why do we need teeth? That is the question on everybody's lips. Oh, we've got access call for this. Insufficient level for door access. Break glass in emergency, certainly. Attention. The Kane medical division is not responsible for injuries or cardiac events resulting from the premature removal of this device. Oh, that's shocking. <laughs> what? Nothing? Come on. Right, a defib. There's something that needs electrical charge we can use. So 1.271 million in debt. He only had secured level one, so this key card's probably not gonna work. Well it said secured level one plus, didn't it? I think. Yeah, we give the car to her, and I think she can she can use this.
Because maybe the clearance means level one and up. Not like one plus, you know what I mean? Like where one doesn't count. I might be wrong. That's where we came in. I forgot where the terminal was already, even though we've just done it. Take a look. Must be in this room. Yeah, it is. Maintenance panel. Right, let's go. Give me that. Yeah, baby. Eject hydro transformer. No, I don't want to turn the lights off. Eject that. Water flow. Hydro transformer. Turn off mule lights. Why would we want to do that though? Non-essential lights. Right, that, that's probably not a good sign. The line... Right. So... Since we've gave access to that... I've worked with these before, they utilise an ocean's current to generate current, however the voltage is rather low. Oh, there we go. We can pump up the jam on this bad boy. The fibrillator needs an extra jolt of power. The hydro generator ought to do it. The fibrillator with generator. I'm a little surprised this didn't explode when we Frankenstein the power couplings together. This is going to deliver one hell of a shock. What do we need to shock though? Ah, gold cap teeth. Maybe we can use that as, as a, a form of conduction. Right. Come on then. Let's get back to this control panel, see if we can... Hopefully this is on now. I don't fancy walking all the way back. No. Okay, what about the bear? Can't really do anything with a bear at the minute. Insufficient security level. Hmm. We're actually stuck in this room. I don't know if this is going to help or not. Try and blow the door off. We're only supposed to blow the bloody door off. Why do we have a question? Oh, wait there. 9422. Well, lads, I'm stumped. Can we. Oh, wait there. Can we break this apart? No. Trying to get the gold out of them. No point in breaking that apart. Can we break this apart? No point in doing that. It's 
It's gotta be the bear. We've been in here. The reason why I know we've been in this terminal is because I've changed the background every single terminal to say a cane corporation, so I know that I've accessed it. Hmm. Can we leave this area completely? I think, oh we can! We can go back into the vents. Right, okay, I think I know where we need to go then. We've mutilated that guy already. There's a vent down here we've never been through. Come on, bear. There we go. We light this up like a Christmas tree. We can smash it, maybe. Oh, wait, they're there. Nope. Torch it. There we go. Cutting torch deployed. Let me in. Actually love the bay. I love the way it looks. It's hideous. You are in that central processing, a restricted area. Bing bong. What did that say? Error. Error. Seven four seven seven four three one. Completely wrong. <laughs> seven, seven four three one nine four two two nine four two two. Ah, escalated privileges. Elevate access by employee and ID. We could have you another guy. Remember we had the cord on that guy's arm? I think we've still got access. No, we don't have access to that area anymore. Fine. Right, there we go. Personal log of this guy. Lake Cubilius. Organic computing. Chris, I remember the day I first saw you. You were standing at the landing of the escalator, waiting to meet your friend for lunch. That friend happened to be Mike, and Mike happened to be trying to hook us up. We made googly eyes at each other, and a few days later, we went on an actual date. A week later, I sucked you off! We moved in together every morning. I brought you your first cup of coffee every morning until I miss you. I hope I'll dream of you tonight. Excerpt. Effects of PS139 on genetic structure. While transmission occurs primarily via respiration, with some evidence showing infection also spreading via ingestion, the fascinating symptoms begin with seeding the nervous system. Excruciating death is not interesting apparently. The microbe in effect hijacks strands of the host RNA, incorporating its genetic materials into the host genome. Memories? I must dig up the old research that the shark guy mentioned. This rogue material contains, among other things, a segment of non-coding DNA that we can suspect is responsible for upregulating gene expression on an exponential scale. Rapid neural development. What graft are we? What graft was missing? While the symptoms caused by PS139's growth in the lungs are too severe for the human body to survive for long, in more robust hosts, it could lead to drastic changes in behaviour and personality. Eventually, even to new cellular physiology. No physiology, no personality, no problem. Notice all organic computing division members. Okay, everyone, heads up. The new VAT brain is arriving tomorrow. The board only provided us with this new model because of the projected value of the research we're doing here. Please handle the equipment with the utmost care as we take over its maintenance during the final weeks of mat maturation. I'd rather not end up at a debt realignment center on the ring. Chris, I just remembered that storm at the old Orange Grove house. It knocked out the electricity and we made shadow puppets on the wall and talked nonsense until the lights came back. Bassagard gave me an idea. It could screw up their precious vat, but 
if there's a chance. Don't worry, I'll be careful. I've been using the ventilation systems to access central processing between shifts. I miss you so much. Remember our favourite Carl Sandberg poem? No one cares. Chris, I was thinking back when James was three. I'd sing him a lullaby before bed, that annoying one, go to sleep. And after a week, he changed the words to be about me and sang it back to us. I've partitioned off each of the VAT brain's right hemispheres to be used solely for the regular computing requirement of the mule. With the increased processing power of dense neural paths created by the microbe, no one should think it is odd that they're only using half their brains for the task they're being given. The other half of each brain is mine. I've done some tampering. The VAT should be restricted to my implanted memories from before your diagnosis, before it all went to shit. Now we have to make sure no one gets snoop no one goes snooping. On a base full of people whose literal job is to be inquisitive, it should be fun. Hidges Basagard. The mule wackadoodles keep messaging me. I never respond. His protruding mechanical organs make me uncomfortable. Chris, did I ever tell you that your impossible father approved of me in the end? In a moment of lucidity, he told me, I envy you, I never got to visit space. So after Parkinson's took him, James and I built a model rocket and launched it into the heavens as a tribute to old grumpy grandpa. Your absence is void at the centre of my life, but soon that will change. The matter fibre pathways in the hippocampus, the prefrontal cortex and the basolateral amygdala have been successfully mapped based on the archived cortical engrams that I kept from before Chris's illness. Jesus Christ, these guys. Shit. Liver Sage reviewed the baselines for VAT1 and noticed that the increased neural activity, I need to think fast. Robert have been tinkering with the VAT mule temporal sequencing to maximize the data throughout. As a result, you can expect to see some universal activity in the Meg readings. This is perfectly normal. The Meg. I'm so close. The high resolution neuroimaging data shows excellent results. There is now a complete structural and functional neural engram of Chris's brain synapse in VAT1. Just before James was born, I woke up to a soaking wet bed. I shouted, quick, get this into the laundry. You were flabbergasted. I screamed. I'm not leaving until it's w until the washing is done and the, m the house is clean. Is the house clean? This guy chats so much shit. Chris, I'm detecting multiple neural paths set in the VAT system. What are you doing? If I pick this up, then Liver Sage will too. Milford is already snooping this month. Has felt like a beautiful dream, but I have till the sorry, but I have to end it before everything comes crashing down. They can't have you. I'm scared. You abandoned James. You left me to die. Don't leave us again. Right? Okay. That was pretty. I mean, I would kind of prefer if these logs were cut down to just the information about. The shit that's going down on the station. I don't really care for the personal relationships of people's stories. It's not interesting. I'm only interested in death, carnage, and destruction. Keep it to that. Keep it to the exciting shit. Right, we can't. Oh no, we can't walk through here. Overgrown door. Dead brain. Give me the brains. Brains. What? No, he's right. It's a cane brain vat. Biocomputers, the base's primary servers. They do not hum. They're offline. No wonder we couldn't connect back. That one looks more than offline. It looks dead. It's the same plant-like growth we saw in the ducks. Does that mean it's a contaminant? Contaminant. Profit. Or reckoning. Okay. Mobile Autodoc Endoscope. VAT 2 at suboptimal performance level. VAT 1 isn't connected, but VAT 1 was this guy's boyfriend or whatever. Mule connection to DS15 is not available. Can we look inside my bum with this? <laughs> Shove it up your ass. Endoscope. Not gonna lie, lads. I don't know what that is. Endoscope. Can we break it? Does that help the situation? No. Breaking things does not help this time.
endoscope and scope. And it is shoving something up your ass, isn't it? Or maybe it's soaking something inside you. Possibly, maybe. Right, we've got some sort of clues here. Do we have to a calibrate a key card, maybe? Engorged brain. The gargantuan brain undulates softly at rivulets of blood trickle from down through its cerebral folds. The rhythmic motion occasionally tugs at the cluster of cables thrust haphazardly into the organic structure, as if weakly attempting to free itself. I want to light it up like a Christmas tree. Or not. Stab it. I don't think we can do anything with this, there's no... Well, maybe not yet. Set it on fire? Probably a bad idea. Okay. Door is shut. Oh, we can use the key card. It's wrong. A tumor. Like ourselves. He's right. It is a tumor. It's stopping the node from functioning. It's not a tumor. So, the bear's gonna have to remove it. Oh, we're gonna have to do some surgery. Vat lock, foreign DNA detected. Remove foreign material from the VAT1 or whatever that is, something cortex. Okay. Oh, there it is. Is that it there? Did we just grab it? No. Oh, endoscope. Okay, Mose. You can do this. I am a very small bear now. <laughs> Don't get ahead of yourself. I am a surgeon. Intracranial foreign body latin scan. Oh, this is wild. I mean, is that normal? I don't know what what is what is normal, what isn't. Simulated. Ah. So we've got a three. There's nothing at three. We're back at one. Go to two. We're at six. Go to five. Wait there, do are we Oh are we just have do we just have to cut these parts? Where have we not been? We've been Oh we never got to five, did we? Let's try six. Still 
I mean... Shunt fail. Separating the battery. Lights regrowth 100%. I'm not done with a fucking clue what I'm doing here. Oh, so nothing ha it just it just keeps regrowing. Right. Maybe you have to do each one in a certain pattern. I don't know what that's for. Um, maybe you... Stimulate. That takes us to three. So by going, if you put their numbers in, if you put your own number in, it takes you to two. If you put your own number in, it takes you back to six. A semicircle, two circles. Ah, that's what you have to do. Stimulate it, shunt it, sever it. Motherfucker. Right, this is, this is going to be very difficult. So left left for examination. See, well I know that. Wait, that that's just a, has that just appeared? Has that always been there? That's weird. Maybe it just threw me a bone because I'm fucking useless. That's what we do. Right, so let's go to one. That should put us. At, let's just stimulate. Let's go back. Let's put our own number in. Shunt. That works. And now, also. Then we have to go one again. 
simulate. Three. Can't do three. Do one again. Don't I, I don't know I don't know what this fucking means. Did it. Did it. It's best just to go with the same number, whatever number you're at. We can't do that anymore. So let's just try something else. Let's try two. Stimulate. Just see where we are. Six. So now we press six. Shouldn't it? Then press the same... Oh, because it doesn't show you. We, knew, we know six and two work, so if I press two... Now we can sever it. Excellent. But the problem is because I've only just realized like I, I didn't explore the other numbers. Five. Stimulate. That's four, so we're gonna press our own number. Four. Junt. Five, and then cut. We did it, bro. I mean, I'm a surgery beast. Mose, you're amazing. For a bear, quite a hard puzzle, lad. Now I should be able to connect to this bastard. Pain fast processing unit, boot up complete. All pathways open for connection. Here we go. Here we go, baby. Tempt to connect. To deep sea 15. Until connection can be established. Right, I don't know what that means. Like, why did we even do that? Uh, lads, I don't know what that got us. Right, I've got no idea what that did. What did that do? Ah, oh, unlocked door. Got it. Doors open. Right, well, I know that was unlocked because we did it on the terminal before, but 
what are we I, I don't know what we generally don't genuinely don't know what we did with that brain don't know how it benefits us I'm inside I don't know it looks like a tunnel an umbilical even there's a what uh, suitcases bags people were leaving they look ransacked told to gather there to be ready to leave these people didn't go anywhere neither did I yeah we know he's still in the station Exterior lighting has afflicted the passage of glazed glass with a jaundiced glow, appearing aching to a writhing intestinal tract. Hey, crazy voice. Where does this go? It connects the mule to the dig site. Dig site? What we were here for. The mistakes we made. What mistakes? What happened here? You were part of it. What was this place? Choices. Consequences. My head. This guy's just going to be a talking head, I bet. Charlie. Look at this. Christ. It's huge. It is pretty. Not the word I'd use. At the bottom of the ocean. You are in the blister. You are where it all begins. This guy's really starting to affect my tranquility. You are in the blister, a restricted area. Remote access terminal. What's uh, that? Military hardware. Allows critical systems to be controlled remotely. You can control anything on the base with it? As long as it has the right transmission equipment, yes. We've got the crane. Right, give me this. Oh, that doesn't use that. What would go in there? Definitely not a key card. Something. Definitely not that. Hmm. Okay. We do need to get a power. Unless there's a power cell that goes in there. A regular power cell. Which we've seen before. Greetings, child of Cain. Have we met before? No, we haven't. Hounds. Piles of wet mud. Or oh, mounds. Mounds, not hounds. Release the hounds! Gamer 11-7. Ah. Definitely gold. We got copper and gold. I don't know what I need to print yet. It's going to have to be a circuit board for that. We'll have to have a closer look at it. It's sealed. Looks military grade. Is it possible the rest of the crew is on the other side? 
forced in and and sealed in. Kate wouldn't do that. Is that really what you think? They wouldn't. Not to their own people. Is that really what you think? Yeah, they would definitely do that to their own people. Right, let's have a closer look at this. I am here to remind you that your time in this world is limited. I am statistically assured that's that you it, you slag. Insert control board. Mm. How would you know? It looks like wires come off that back corner. Up a right, down the bottom left. That's my best fucking guess. Look at this, I just realized a statue here. Sculpture, colossal humanoid sculpture broods behind the steel scaffold. Right, what I'll do is, I don't know. Shout it to you, mug. Let's make a save. Because in case we fuck this up. I imagine it would give us infinite attempts at this. Plastic. It could be that, you know. Copper, golden, carbon. We're missing the raw material a bit. Oh, it tells you, man, lads, I've just, lads, I'm so poor at observation skills. Schema 2 4. Where did we. Where did we see? Schema 1 7. Where did we, lads? I I specifically remember recently seeing schema. It wasn't on this, or was it on this? Schema. Fuck. Where did we see that? Right, tell you what we're going to do lads, I am going to call an episode here, because I need to review the video footage on where I saw the word schema, I remember looking at it and I'm sure it had a 7 in it, schema 1771, schema some shit, or was, or was it, am I just remembering what I actually saw on this control Child panel, I hate how when people are talking you can't access things. Maybe I did just see it here. 
I definitely need some more raw materials. There's, there's no doubt about it. Right, what we'll do is we'll call an episode there. I'm going to review the footage. Let's see if I can find out where I saw that. We'll save the game. But we definitely know we need to create a control board for that. We might have to do some more exploring with another character. Although, I'm not going to lie, I'm a bit stumped on where to, where to go. See if I can figure it out. Hope you do the episode, lads. See you in the next one.